Well, post May 4th, 1970, there was a lot of interest expressed by university families for full day programs for preschool aged children. Um, the early childhood program on campus stepped in to uh, offer a laboratory school for children of that age and uh, the school currently serves uh, 150 children uh, from 18 months through kindergarten. I have a long history here. I've been here uh, since I was a college student back in the late 70s. So um, this, is how, this place has always had a special place in my heart. But um, I, I think what I love best about teaching here and being here is the relationships that we build with the children and the families and with each other as teachers and faculty here. We're a laboratory school, so we serve as a professional development site for the students who are majoring in early childhood education. Uh, we do have a college classroom in the building, so some of the early childhood courses are taught in the building. Uh, by not only teachers in the classroom, but also other early childhood faculty members. And uh, we are able to host anywhere from uh, 25 to 30 undergraduate early childhood students each year. I absolutely love it. This is the best place, I think, to be placed, honestly. Um, Every day I come in, all the kids run, Miss Rothermel, Miss Rothermel. <laughs> I love coming here every day. I come Monday through Friday, and it's just a great atmosphere. You can really tell the community that the CDC has really built around the classrooms and the parents and the children, of course. We do give priority to current university families. So primarily, most of our children are children of faculty, staff, or students. Uh, and we have maybe about five to eight percent of our families are just affiliated with the community. We want our children to be lifelong learners and to really have a love of learning and so we encourage them to embrace problems, that problems are good things and so when, when a problem comes up, whether it's between children or a social issue like the litter out on the, on the campus, we sit together and we talk about what can we do about this and how can we make changes. Typically in many other programs it focuses on skills and academics, um, knowing your numbers, knowing your letters. We feel that comes naturally when children have a purpose for knowing those things. So when they are engaged in long-term investigations and projects with their peers and they have to articulate their ideas, communicate them, negotiate, then they find that there are meaningful reasons to write their name or to learn how to spell something or to engage in mathematical thinking. Every day is like a special gift with the children here. They, they just bring so much um, curiosity and, and um, fun to the classroom. So I, I look forward to every day just seeing their faces and seeing the families come in and building those relationships. It's much better than just reading a book about children. Like you actually see learning happening in the classroom. You see all these different aspects of the classroom come out and you really learn how to become a teacher. 